Hey guys, if your generative fill is not showing up, you simply need to follow instructions in this tutorial. First, on top navigation bar, go to help and go to updates. This is going to open your Adobe Cloud desktop. First thing you want to do is go to beta apps, locate the most recently installed Photoshop and go to these three dots over here and click uninstall, then click on the remove button. Now in the upper left corner, go to updates. Now this is important and probably the step you've forgotten to do. In the upper right corner, click check for updates. Now next to Photoshop, click on update. This is the version with a generative fill. Once installed, go back to beta apps and just to check, go to these three dots again and this time go to previous versions. Now make sure that the installed version is at least 24.7. Anything below 24.6 is why your generative fill is not showing up. Now, this is also important. Make sure to close any previously open photoshops in the background and only then click on the open button from here. Now you can close Adobe Cloud Desktop and the new Photoshop with generative fill will start loading up. Here to test the generative fill tool, I'm going to select the entire image and click on generative fill. In the text prompt, I'm going to type highly detailed desert panorama. It's going to give me three different images. Then I'm going to select part of that image with the selection tool. Click generative fill button and type crash landed spacecraft. Click on the generate button. And here I have three different versions of crash landed spacecraft. Now this entire box right here with a generative fill button is called contextual taskbar. If even after updating Photoshop, it's still not showing up, go to a window and at the bottom here, make sure to check contextual taskbar.